My God is greater. That doesn't die. I'm an eagle. I was born to fly. I'm a new creation. I'm one of a kind. Oh, I'm spirit. See the fire in my eye. I hail from heaven. I'm sanctified.
Yes, guys, welcome to Gossens TV. Here is your own down to you, man. Uh, we got we got It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be very, 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 very prophetic today, and it's gonna be the fire full of Holy Ghost fire today because we're talking about the new creation. And I want to read from the Second Corinthian right now. I want you to take a moment first, share this uh, broadcast with somebody is strongly in the need of this because because this is the gospel of Jesus Christ and it's the need of every every single mankind so I'm going to read from 2nd Corinthians chapter 5 verse 7 it says therefore if anyone in Christ watch out if anyone in Christ he is a new creation and old has gone away or old has been passed away behold all things have become new you're watching me I want to tell you if you are baptized and if you are if you have accepted Jesus already I want to tell you welcome and let's welcome other people to the family of God let's welcome other people to the kingdom of God and you got to share this broadcast with somebody because somebody has got to need this message today of a new creation in Christ we are the new creation hallelujah praise the Lord in Christ we are brand new because because we were living the life of the sin we were living this life on a darkness we were living the life of sickness and illness but in Christ it's finished on the cross of Calvary and we are in the DNA of daddy God and that's what the John chapter 3 verse 6 is talking about. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believe shall not be perished but have an everlasting life. You got to believe. You got to see. You got to see. You know, if you're, if you're new and you're, you're just talking what crap I'm talking about right now, it's not a crap. It's the word of God. It's a book of life. It's, it's, it's a life. It's, it's a light to your life. I'm telling you. It's, it's an epic. It's an, a, gospel of, a gospel of truth. Is the Bible talk about Jesus the way, the truth, and life? And the truth, the Bible says, the truth will set you free. As you are hearing this truth today, you are listening to me right now, you're watching me. I speak in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Be free from every bondage in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Set free right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ because there is a power in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. When you talk about Jesus, there is a power begin to take an action. There is things begin to take an action because there is a power the Bible talks about. So we are the new creation because we live in the power. We live in that dominium right now. We live in that setup right now. You know, you, I, I want to say this thing. When you, when you want to do of this, when you do want to, I'm going to give this example. When you do a Facebook live, you want to reach a broadcast to the people, this broadcast. We, we got to set up the camera, we got to set up the light, we got to set up the mic and a lot of stuff. We got to set up the PCs and computer and all this stuff. We got to set up things. We got to prepare for it to come in life and talk to you guys. That's what God prepared his son. That's what the Bible says in John chapter 3 verse 6. He only gave, the, he gave only his begotten son for you and I. For what? To keep living the life of sin? To keep living the life of darkness to keep living no we are the brand new creation the time except jesus christ if you are watching me right now you're talking about okay you know accepting jesus it's been years but nothing happened to you into my life i want to tell you you are coming up from the poverty because the thing that's that's what the word of god says for your sake god become poor so you might become rich god himself to his son he become a poor for you to be what to poor no for you to be living in a life of prosperity people talk uh, people a lot of people says um, having money is a, is an evil thing i say the bible says love of money is an evil the roof of all evil but having money is not an evil you can have money and you can do something with that money you are a new creation i gotta tell you today is your day your best is on ahead of you because nothing is impossible when God is with us. And remember the possibility God has given to us. He gave his only begotten son for us. You are a new creation. I want to read this, you know. I want to read this from John right now. It says in John chapter 15 verse 5. That I am the, I am the tree. Let's talk about this way. And we are the branches of the tree. Jesus Christ is the tree. If, watch it out. If you remain in me, I and I in you, you will bear much fruit. As part from me, you can do nothing. You're struggling for many, many years. In part from Christ, you can do nothing. If you're going through a sickness, illness, poverty right now, 
Apart from Christ, you can do nothing. You got to come to Christ. You got to know your identity in Christ. Before you get to know your identity in this world, you want a solution in your broken family, but you don't want to get to Jesus. You want a solution of broken family in a broken world. It's impossible. Hallelujah. You got to believe. You got to believe for this way. God has an amazing plan. God has an awesome plan for you. The Bible says he loves us so much. Hallelujah. I want to, I want to, I want to take a, take a, a let's, re, let's read it this way. It says here, uh, in Romans chapter 8 verse 9, it says, In Christ we have his spirit. Remember that. It's talk about, in Christ we have his spirit. You, however, are not in the redemption of the flesh, but are redeemed on the, of the spirit. If indeed the spirit of the God lives in you, and if anyone does not have the spirit of Christ, they do not belong to Christ. Now, you might be saying, oh, okay, what man of God is talking right now? We don't belong to Christ because we don't have a spirit of Christ. I don't belong to Christ. I belong to the law. I don't belong to Jesus Christ. You belong to the Jesus Christ, even being in law. Because Jesus came to fulfill the law. What was written in the Old Testament? It was a fulfillment in the New Testament. You got, you got a separate Bible. Remember this. You are a new creation, but get you cannot separate the Bible. The Bible is the Bible. The Bible is a trial. Let me tell you. I want, I want, I want, I want to be, you will need to be thankful when you are a new creation. You got to see the miracles happening over your life. You got to see the, the great things taking place over your life. You got to be very much obedient to the word of God. When you obey to the word of God, you see the life coming. You see the great things coming up. You know, Pastor, uh, Pastor how I can be obedient? Now, here, here, here's, here are the word I will give you. 1 Corinthians chapter 6 verse 90 says, You do, do, do you not know that your bodies are the temple of a Holy Ghost? I'm talking something today. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta listen. It's gonna be hard, but it's gonna be epic. Who is in you whom you have received from God? You are not your own. In other words, you do not know your bodies are the temple of living God. Holy Ghost, your bodies are the temple of the Holy Spirit. You gotta, you gotta fix your, fix your, fix yourself, you know, before, before you come out and fix, you know. If it, Pastor, you know, I, I met somebody, you know, I, I got very shocked when I see this thing. Uh, a gay buying, I, I don't want to talk about this thing, but gay buying a period span. Can you imagine that? And when you begin to ask a gay, what are you doing, buddy? And I asked one of the person, I says, what, what, why are you doing this? He says, because, because I'm a girl. And I say, if you're a girl in a man body function, then what about me? I should buy the pads too. I should gotta buy, I, I should gotta buy, buy the pads. <laughs> my, my guy's laughing at the back. You gotta, you gotta know the word of God because that's the book of life, amen. You, the Bible says in Zion, it says, my people die because of what? The lack of knowledge. My people don't die because of what? Having the knowledge, my people die. The Bible says, my people die because of the lack of knowledge. And what is the lack of knowledge? Anything that is outward of God is hell. Remember that. Anything that comes out of the word of God is absolutely hell. You got to be confused to your gender. You got to be a lesbian. You got to be a gay. You got to be having something in your life. And you might be thinking, okay, I'm confused. And maybe I'm created like that. I need to have a legalization into my life to get married with that and this. I need to have a man into my life and man to man and woman to woman. And let me tell you, that from the Genesis to the Revelation, God only talk about the man and woman. God is not producing anything. And that is a new creation. Hallelujah. New creation is not coming from the different genders. New creation is a man and woman that is born again and they are from God. Amen. Hallelujah. New creation. This is a revelation. This is a revelation of new creation. Hallelujah. You got it. You got it. You know, I, I was surprised seeing the gate. 
I'm not against anybody, guys, listen. But this is the message of new creation. You might be saying, evangelism, you got to know this. We got a new creation. Hallelujah. In Australia, we got we to gotta choose the genders. Who we want to be? Who we, if, a, if a boy want to be a girl or a girl want to be a boy, it's a freaking heavy world. Look at the new, new creation. That's the new creation. The Bible says, you do not know even that your body does not belong to you. Hallelujah. Your body does not belong to you, people of this world. I'm talking to you. Your body belongs to the Holy Ghost. Your body belongs to Daddy God who gives you this body. It belongs to Him. Hallelujah. The new creation is this. The new message, the new revelation, the gospel of Christ is this. That, that you got a light into your, into your path. And how you get the light into your path? When you begin to know the truth. And what is the truth? The word of God. You got to live from the word of God. I want to talk to those believers and sitting around just thinking. We got to produce the gospel of Jesus Christ. We, we got to preach the gospel of Jesus Christ. Just sitting down, sitting down, sitting down. And thinking that's what they are doing a lot for the kingdom of God. Just stop thinking in this way. Stop making fool of yourself. I want you to take up your Bible, go on a street, and save somebody today. This is a time to share Jesus with somebody today. This is a moment to share Jesus with somebody today, because we are no longer old. We are the new creation. We belong to the daddy God DNA. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Recently, just last time we talked about, we talk about the, uh, what do you call that, uh, we talk about the blood, the victory in the blood of Christ. We got a victory in the blood of Christ. How? Because when we are a new creation, we, can, we, need, to, we need to renew our sense of humor and the and, and our sense of us that, that, that God, God is doing something really, really amazing. Hallelujah. God is doing awesome things. You got you to gotta believe for it. You got to believe for this. Hallelujah. You got to believe for this. Somebody is watching us. I want to just say hi. Uh, this this be a typical name for me, but thank you for watching. Whoever's watching me right now, uh, God bless you, and yeah, see you. So we got we got to have a break right now. Nothing is impossible to God if you want to experience His miracle, change your life, and you need to obey His word. And I want to say thank you all those who are watching.
will run and not be weary The race that's set before me In Christ I have the victory Oh, for I know The price that Christ paid for me This is more than just a story Can you see? There's a song I want uh, Martin P.K. to sing tonight. You've got several, but um, not Holy Spirit. You sing that one later on, okay? You know the number one song? Superman. <laughs> so can you sing that right now? Okay, let's have Superman. How many of you have Superman here? Say, I'm a Superman. I'm a Superman. <laughs> Look to your neighbor and say, I'm flying. I'm flying. Say, I'm flying with eagle's wings. Say, I can do all things. Because God lives in me. Say, I'm a Superman. I can do all things. I can do anything. Oh, you can call me Superman. I, for the Spirit of God lives in me and me and me. Oh, He's given me the ability. I, 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 I. So take a good look at me. I'm living in prosperity. I, 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 I walk by faith and not by sight. Hey. Oh, it's not by power, no, by mind. Hey, right now. Oh. So I can do. Take a good look at me, yeah. So take a good 
Spirit of God, the same Spirit that raised Jesus from the dead. He lives inside of me, every fiber of my being. Hey, he has given me the ability. Yes, guys, welcome back from the break. Uh, thanks for the normal and uh, uh, Ira and Stella for watching. And uh, thank you for sharing too. God bless you guys. And uh, I'm, 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 I'm excited what we are doing. I see, I see we are reaching, we are reaching already. The reach of the people is gone thousands. Wow, Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord, for doing this, you know. Keep sharing with the people. Keep sharing with the people. You know, because you are, you are, we are coming tomorrow on the same time, 7 uh, Manila time, evening. We are coming live on the same topic, new creation, part B. 
It's gonna be epic. It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be a zooming fire one. So, so, so we were talking about this. I want to give you another example of a new creation. Can you see the glass with the cola inside? There is a cola inside. Oh, let's take it. This is you as a glass. You and I. Let's go like this. And the sin is making us empty day by day, day by day. I'm gonna sip it down. Oh. Sin is making you empty. Devil is, devil is just sucking down you. And sin is making you empty. You gotta be. Keep going down every day. Going down every day. And you gotta, you gotta say, okay. God to love me, man. You gotta take a step to see the fulfillment of God in your life. You can just sit down as being a man of God and think I'm winning source, but still sitting now. You can, you, can, you can go on the street and preach Jesus, and then you can even say, I want more souls for Jesus. Fulfillment happens the time you take a step into something. You want an iPhone, you got to be in iPhone shop. You, you, if you're in a Samsung, or you, if you're in a, if a China, China phone shop, anything, you are, you are there. You got you to gotta get the, that bread, you know. Remember, if you want something, you go for that thing. Now, when the sin is making you empty, God is watching you over. God is watching you. That sin is taking away. The so sin is sucking you too much and you're going down, 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 down. And then some of the crazy singers, thank God, they are coming on the way to Jesus. They say, baby, are you down, 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 down? You know, northern singers, they got to know the gospel of Jesus, you know. Before they tell the baby, you are down, down, down. Jesus did not make baby down, down, down. Jesus make a baby to be your shoulder. Hallelujah. Jesus make your wife to be a shoulder of yours. Jesus gave you an life to live with the abundance of blessings. Not with the one of the blessings or two of the blessings, but with the abundance of blessings. God has an amazing plan. God got to do something over your life, you know. So when sin is taking you down, 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 that's where the John chapter 3 verse 16 talk about. For God so loved the world, which means God loves you so much. Take away all your sickness, all your sins, all your diseases, all your poverty. Take away on the cross of the Calvary. And he, get, he died on the cross of Calvary and he got buried. Not only he got buried, but he rose up after 30 and he lived inside of you and I. You and I. Hallelujah. We are no longer who will live, but the Christ, Jesus Christ, live inside of us. The, the, the Bible says in John 10, 10, devil come to steal, to kill, to destroy. But Jesus says, I come to give you an abundance life. Begin to receive the abundance life right now. God has an amazing future for you. God will want to see you keep, 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 keep swelling down, down, down. And then you got to say, okay, maybe God has no plan for you. That was a Jeremiah 29, 11 says, for I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. Plans to prosper you, not to harm you. Plans to give you the great hope and the future God has a great plan for you yeah I'm talking to you I'm talking to somebody right now God has an amazing plan for you you are the new creation you are a new creation in Christ you don't belong to your sins anymore you don't belong to the sickness anymore you don't belong to the cancer you don't belong to the TV you don't belong to the age you don't belong to the any creepy hell sickness you belong to the DNA of Jesus Christ which means you are a new creation and you are a child of most high God hallelujah praise the Lord you gotta believe you gotta believe you gotta believe and receive because God loves you so much he loves you, you gotta you gotta see things happen when you begin to trust the Lord when you begin begin to receive right now I'm speaking to somebody you're going to a, going to a swear sickness right now I'm speaking to you in the name of Jesus. I come with the almighty power right now. And I speak the healing declaration. I declare it to your life. You are completely healed by the stripes of Jesus. You are healed. You are delivered. Every devil plan be cast out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every demonic attack be out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Begin to receive.
Laboroshi, you, you receive the prosperity, lover. I see, I see God is making you something from nothing to something, nothing to somebody. In the name of Jesus Christ, you gotta believe, you gotta believe for that. You know, uh, if you want to, I want to share, I want to share this thing. If you want to get my first book that I wrote, I'm broken, no mess, no message. You can comment down right now. We will give you free, of course, but you can also get it on Amazon. I'm broken, no mess, no message. But for, we can give you for free. If you're watching us right now, you can comment down, get it for free, and you can just message us, inbox us. We're going to give you for free. God has an amazing plan, I want to tell you. Because, because, because remember, if you're broken today, there is a good news coming up today to your life. Your family is going through a crisis. There's a fight going into your family. I see you are a new creation. You are a child of God. You no longer belong to the darkness. It belongs to the light and the light of God. The light of the word of God. Remember this. Pastor, how I can get healed? Live from the word of God. Live in the word of God. The healing comes from the word of God. It doesn't come from right, left, south, north, east. It's only come from the word of God. I want you to read from Jeremiah 20, uh, 20, 30, 33 chapter. And it says in verse uh, 11. 11 and 11 says, Give thanks to God Almighty, for the Lord is good. His love endures forever. I want, you to, I want you to share and say, God loves, lives forever. You begin to make it person. God loves, lives forever for me. God loves me so much. Begin to make it person. I'm going to give some declarations right now. If you're speaking out with me right now, I'm talking to you. You are, you are, you are the next person getting a good news in next coming 24 hours in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Begin to declare these things with me right now. I'm speaking to you. Let's, let's, let's speak together. I'm a child of God. The sickness cannot stop what God has for me. The devil cannot stop what God has me for me. The, the, the poverty cannot stop what God has for me. I'm going to fly. Now, here's the deal. Make it possible. I'm going to fly. And I'm going to fly like an eagle. God is renewing my strength. The Bible talks about that. He will renew your strength like an eagle. Say, I am an eagle. I am an eagle of daddy God. I got to fly high. I got to fly high. No sickness, no disease, no poverty, no cancer, no AIDS, no nothing. No gender miscommunication can stop me because I got to fly high. New creation means that you are born of God, not born of different kind of genders. Hallelujah. I want to clarify a lot of churches are going to this darkness and they are thinking they are producing the gospel of Jesus Christ. Be strict. Be mature. Be wise. That's the word of God for you today. Be mature. Be strict. Be wise. If you want to see things. If, if, if you have a lack of knowledge, ask the wisdom from God. Say, Lord, give me a wisdom. Give me a knowledge. Give me an understanding. Be, 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 a, be a person going to God, not begging for money, but begging God. Begging in this way, thanking God and saying, thank you what you have done. Stop being a religious people, begging God, Oh Lord, do this for me, Lord, you gotta make it happen for me. Oh Lord, please, please, please. No, Lord is not a foolish. He is a key. He, he is not a foolish. You gotta be, please, please, please for him. You gotta, you gotta set it. I'm a child of yours, Lord. And you know, you can let the son of line, the child of line be hungry, but you can never let your own believer, your own child be stay hungry. Stay focused, guys. Stay focused. The word of God has the power. I want to say, as you, as you heard, as you, as you heard this word of God, sh challenge your, yourself and die to yourself. Let's live for the God. God has an amazing plan. Ja, there is a guy watching us. He's from the Philippines, right? And uh, J, J A Y, something like that. God bless you. And then what else? We have another name. What is the other name? Who is this? Is it, is it one name? Wow, guys. Okay, thank you for this. He's watching us. I think this is the second time I got the name. Thank you, uh, this guy who's watching us. I don't know why you're coming up again and again. Okay, let me say this word. Before we go to the break, bring, him, bring that back. Bring that, bring that back. I'm going to pray for this guy. I'm going to pray for him. J. 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 R. 
His name is very, very tripping name. Okay, I'm going to pray for you right now. You're listening to me. He's watching right now. Uh, yeah, I'm going to pray for you right now. God's giving you the good news. J R. That's a Filipino name. Okay, you got me. Okay, <laughs> you're watching me. It's complicated. Name. I'm talking to you right now. God is giving you the good news in the name of Jesus Christ. Begin to receive. Begin to receive in the name of Jesus Christ. J R. I'm talking to you. You are completely healed. You are completely delivered. You are going to the next level of your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Next level. I see you, you deserve to be on a next level. You deserve to be. Next level is coming to you in the name of Jesus Christ. Begin to trust. And as you hear this word of God, I want to say this again. Challenge yourself. Die into yourself. Into your self-desires. And see the God doing something good in your life because he has a plan for you. Blessings. See you after the break. Very calm. To That's set before me In Christ I have the victory Oh, for I know The price that Christ paid for me This is more than just a story Can you see His glory on me? One, we are live back and actually you hold a banner in the wrong way <laughs> anyway Jesus loves you guys it's amazing it's epic I'm so glad people are watching us right now and uh, if anybody has a prayer request let's go like this we are going to pray for you right now anyone has a prayer request we got to pray for you live right now 
Live, we are going to pray for you right now. If any prayer requests come there, just let me know. Diba? If any prayer requests come, just let me know. And we're going to pray for you guys. It's going to be epic. It's going to be amazing. Remember, what is the meaning of new creation? You are a child of God. You are born of God. Devil can make you empty. That's what the Bible says in John 10. Devil come to steal, to kill, to destroy. But Jesus come to give. Abundance life. You have the abundance life. You have the overflow happening into your life right now as you're watching me this moment. The overflow is taking place into your life. I want to read from one of the one of the words, you know. I'm speaking right now to somebody. You know, God has an amazing plan. God, God, God has an amazing plan. I'm waiting for some of the prayer requests. If you have any prayer requests, begin to send. Begin to send right now. I'm going to pray for you also. I want to read from this. First Corinthians chapter 13 verse 4 says, Love is patient now. You are a new creation. Love is kind. Love does not evil. Love does not boost. It does not boost. It does not proud. It does not dishonor other. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily anger. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not divide, delight in evil, but rejoice with the truth. It always protect and always trust, always hope. Love never fail. Always keep going. Love never fail. Remember this. Which love? Jesus love. Which love you're talking about? The new creation love that gives and given by Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus love is a sobra maganda love. That's a Filipino word. It says too much beautiful love. We have of Jesus love is too much beautiful love. And I want to say that's why we are new creation because his love is too beautiful. His love is so much for us. The Bible says, he loves all mankind. He don't love three people, four people. And if you're watching me right now, you are going confusion. Okay, maybe I'm, I'm not a man. I'm not a girl. You're confusion in your genders. I want to tell you. Christ loves you. When we are in Christ, the word of God says, we are now a new creation. I say, I want to repeat. The word of God says, now we are the new creation. I remember there was a Pharisee, a man came to Jesus and says, the ruler of Jews says, says to Jesus, you, your teachings, the things you do, I want, I'm just giving a short thing on that. Uh, the things you do is, is a sign that you come from God and God is with you. Now remember, if you're watching me right now, the things that are going to happen into your life, people are going to testify and say, this is a sign of God. God is with you. God is going to make, God, God, make it happen into your life. God, God, just because of God, you know, you, 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 you are attached to God and things are happening over your life. You got to believe in this way. You got to, you got to trust the Lord. The Bible says the signs of God is a miracle performing God. God is a keeping covenant God. He's performing the miracles right now, this moment. And I want you to take a moment to share with somebody. I, I, I know somebody is watching me. Your daughter and son is going through a gender thing. From a gender confusion. I speak the confusion be out in the name of Jesus Christ. I, sp I declare the confusion of the genders to be out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you. There is nobody like you. You are yesterday, today, forever the same. If you have a prayer request and you are watching me right now, I want you to put your hand on your head and say, Father, I thank you. I thank you the healing is happening over my life. I am completely healed and I'm a new creation. Begin to thank God. I'm a new creation. I'm a child of God. I'm a born of God. Father, we thank you so much for giving your son on the cross of Calvary and giving us a new life. Giving us a brand new life. And we are no longer who will live, but the Christ Jesus live inside of us. We are no longer who will live, but Jesus live inside of us. Raporo Sikanadoria. Let the great things begin to happen. Let's begin to receive, begin to receive. 
begin to receive, begin to receive in the name of Jesus Christ. Rabu si kanaduria, riburu baba baba si kanaduria. You you got you you got you got you gotta be you gotta send your prayer requests right now. You got you gotta send your prayer requests. You know, if you're watching me right now, I'm talking to you. God has amazing. Somebody somebody wrote a prayer request. Mercy, you you are in the need of mercy. Mary. Um, mercy. Uh, Mary wrote a request for the mercy. Tiba. I'm praying for the mercy in the name of Jesus Christ right now. Now mercy to your family, mercy to your house, mercy to your business, mercy to your work. Right now I speak the mercy of God in the name of Jesus Christ. Mercy of God right now. Begin to receive the mercy of God. You are a child of God. He loves you. God is faithful. God is amazing. God is a great God. Because there is nobody like a God. Rabbo si kanaduria. Begin to receive. Begin to receive. Begin to receive. In the name of Jesus Christ. Begin to receive. Rabbo si kanaduria. Begin to receive. I'm talking to somebody right now. Begin to receive. I'm, 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 I'm telling you. If you're watching me right now. Begin to receive. Begin to receive. The testimony is coming into your house. The testimony is coming into your house. The testimony. The good news. Is coming into your house. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Director, my path. I pray right now for the path in the name of Jesus Christ. Direction of the path in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now, I pray. I pray for the direction of the path in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now. Begin to receive right now this good news. This testimony is happening. Your light is coming to your path. I, I pray right now. Somebody says, uh, uh, pray for my walk with Jesus. I speak right now. You walk with the Jesus. Oh my God. I was, I was waiting for somebody like this. I, I pray right now for you. You're watching me, man. I, I see every devil program, every devil plan that is trying to stop the walk of your walk with Jesus Christ. I give it fire in the name of Jesus Christ. I give fire in the name of Jesus Christ. I give the fire of Holy Ghost. I am not in a church right now. I need God to direct my path. God is directing a path. Listen, you are in the church already. You are watching us live. I'm telling you, Mary, you're already in the church. You're watching us live. You're already in the church. Don't feel like a church. We are doing this Facebook live. We are doing this, all the stuff. Feel like a house. Feel like a family. Feel like a church. Hallelujah. The, if anybody else need, 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 want me to pray for the walk, for the, uh, walk to be, be, be so mature in Christ, I pray right now. Every devil program, every darkness that's trying to stop you not to grow in the light. I give the fire of the Holy Ghost right now. Begin to receive. Begin to receive. I cancel the, I cancel the, every, every brain tumor things. I give the fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Every cancer, every heart problem, I give you the fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Begin to receive. Begin to receive. Because God has an amazing plan. Begin to receive. God loves you so much that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believe shall not be perished but have an everlasting life. I'm talking to somebody right now. Begin to receive. Begin to receive your testimony. Begin to receive your good news. In the name of Jesus Christ, you got to go to the doctor. Double check. Doctor is going to be shocked. God is doing something really amazing. God is performing the miracles right now. It's happening into your life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Begin to receive. 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 I'm, I'm praying for somebody. I'm, I'm, I'm praying for somebody. Begin to receive. Begin to receive. God loves you so much. Remember. God loves you so much. I speak the good news. You're watching me, I speak the good news, begin to receive right now. I speak the good news, receive your good news. Receive your good news. Those people who share this broadcast, I speak, as you took this heart to share the gospel, I speak the good news right now. Princes, watching us right now, we are praying for you, princes. I speak the good news right now to the princes in the name of Jesus Christ. Good news, healing, complete healing, deliverance, be there. Right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, Raburo Sikana Doria. Oh, Nemoro Baba Babara Sikana Doria. Raburo Sikana Doria. Raburo Sikana Doria. Feel it like a church. Guys, listen, whoever watching this, this is a church. We are coming tomorrow live also. Join us. The same timing. You're going to join us. Get notified with our live. Press the bell icon. And this will be uploaded also on YouTube. And all the people on YouTube. Also, thank you for watching. And we're praying for you, Godson's people, YouTube people. Go subscribe, Godson's TV on YouTube. 
we, we are reaching 1,000 people very soon on our YouTube. Go subscribe it. And uh, uh, my show is coming there also. And a lot of encouragement videos are also coming there. And also, I want to say this thing. Uh, go subscribe to Martin Pika's song, uh, Martin Pika channel on YouTube. He's my very, very good brother. And uh, he's my lovely brother. God bless you. God keep you. God has an amazing plan because he loves you so much, manly, badly, crazily. And we are looking for your feedbacks. Don't forget to give your feedbacks. If you want my book, I'm Broken, No Mess, No Message, my first book, you can do a comment or you can message us. We're going we're gonna to send you the book. Lots of love. Your dog. Blessings.